Okay, so today, right now, I'm going to show you how to enable networking um, on your Arch Linux installation. Uh, this is really for a situation where you get yourself into when you um, install the operating system and it seems like networking stops working. What happened is the live image. <clears throat> has networking automatically configured and after you install all the files onto whatever file system and device you you have on your computer or virtual machine you need to reconfigure that uh, that the networking settings so what I'm going to do is just log in quick and the first thing you should probably do if you want to you don't have to this part is kind of optional um, and that would be to configure the host name so as you can see the host name is what comes right after my username in the prompt here so root at arch linux that would make my host name arch linux um, but maybe i want to change that so there's two files we have to uh, alter in order to do that the first file that we need to configure, and actually we need to create it, is the hostname file in the Etsy uh, directory. So you have to uh, change into the Etsy directory, as you can see, I've already done. And uh, whatever you want it to be, um, I'll do sudo admins. And just redirect that into hostname. So we can cat let's see name. And if you've gotten that far, you've done it correct. So uh the second one we need to do is hosts. Uh we need to make sure that it's the same host name in each file, so um otherwise we can run into problems and it's just a, a needless thing. All we're gonna do is add the um, the name to the hosts file. So again, sudo admins and make sure we're concatenating the file rather than uh, just completely replacing it. I think right now we only have comments in the file so it wouldn't be a disaster but it's good practice. So we do that and all right, so now I just restarted the system, and as you can see, the host name is right there, sudo admins login. So I go root, and there it is again. Now it's at the prompt. So now that we have our host name configured, um, we can uh, enable the DHCP uh, client. So the first thing we need to do is find out the name of our wireless interface or network interface, I guess. Um, and that would be through IP link. And as you can see, it's the second one. The first one is a loopback device. So the name of our network uh, device is ENP0S3. So what we're going to have to do is um, enable the DHCP client to use that uh, interface. Um, so we can check the status of that with systemctl status dhcpcd at, and then the name of the, the network device, so ENP0S3. And so as you can see, it's loaded, but it's disabled and inactive. So all we're going to do there, start it, and once that's started, we're going to enable it so that uh, we don't have to start it every time we restart the system. Enable. So then we can check the status of it again, and there it is, it's running, and it's enabled. 
out to make sure that we have a um, a working connection. We can just use ping and ping Google. And as you can see, it works. So press control C to get out of that. And uh, yeah. now you're pretty much good. Um, this is a pretty minimalistic um, setup. Um, there's a lot more that you can do, but I'm just trying to keep it as simple as possible. Um, if you really want all the details of what you should be doing, you should check out the uh, um, the Arch Linux wiki and uh, go from there. All right, thanks.